Center. The first thing I have to do is to get the place centered. Are you recording sound or is this just pictures? Sound as well. Hmm? Sound as well, yeah. Okay. So the first operation is to get the clay centered, which means that it's just spinning nice and concentrically. You have to keep your hands nice and lubricated as well with the water, which is why they have a big bowl of water. The next thing is to open it out, and I side push down into the centre of it. And there's a little air bubble in it. I need to... No, it's a lump of something. That's going to be fun. And then I'm making the base by drawing, pulling it out. Flattening the base with my knuckle inside. And then I start pulling it up. And effectively, I'm squeezing the clay as it rotates between my hand on the outside and my fingers on the inside and it's got no option but to go upwards. See as, as I repeat the process, it gets taller and wider. And just to form the rim, just by shaping my fingers around it. And obviously as I've been running my fingers up and down, you can see all the little furrows that my, my fingers make. I don't really want that on the pot, so I'm now going to use what is in fact a bit of sawn up plastic ruler, but it's got a nice straight hard edge on it. And as I press that into the, the clay and balance it against the fingers on the inside, you can see all those little furrows disappear. And I'm uh, going to end up immediately but eventually with a nice smooth profile. It's now full of water from the previous uh, operation so I just need to dry it off a bit now, get the water out of the the bottom of the pot with a, with a sponge. Just run the sponge over the outside just to remove any minor surface irregularities. And there you go, the pot is made.